Hi Tisa, I'm very glad to be here. Last time we talked about the Buddhistic house. Today we are talking about a, about a very important topic for almost all people in the world, water, and your project Air to Water here and now. Can you describe the topic in a nutshell? Yeah, can I? I can. The, in a nutshell, I will say, as the topic itself share, says, thin air, all parts of the world to milk the thin air to get water to drink. That is the topic. Okay, and what has Dharma and Buddhism to do with this water here and now? Ah, that's a good question. Well, the Buddha said in the discipline codex called Vinaya, Vinaya Pitakaya, there is a, a, a section called, called uh, Pachichaya Pali, page number 23. And this page number 23 says, do not give Dhamma to a person who is seated above the person who is talking about Dhamma. Do not give Dhamma to a person who is drunk, drunkard. Do not give Dhamma to a person who is hungry. So, hungry means you have to have sufficient amount of food as well as water. So, I combined water in this Buddhist house to make this water available to all the people in the world. Yeah, that is one of what is one of the reasons. Okay, did it mean hungry and thirsty? It's the same. Yes, or the same. Yeah, okay. we know. In fact, thirst is more than hunger. Without and without yeah. without food, you can live longer than without water. So water, no water means only seven days. Can you tell me something about how to work with the topic water in general? What was the first idea to say I'll make a water project? Well, it all came from the solar energy as well as it came from, in my country in Sri Lanka, people used to die because of kidney. I heard this very often with my friends, they are kidney problems and fever and used to die. Then I inquire some more, then I saw that in India there is no water or bad water, Amazon now forest is on fire, then uh, there is no water in Iran, there is no water in South Africa, there is water in Berlin, but this is not clean water that is coming on the pipeline. So I thought what is the best way to get not only clean water, but also healthy water. So this was the topic that came through solar energy and bamboo uh, trees as well as this water. They all came together with the Dhamma together. Yeah, all these things came together. It was one of the reasons. But I understand you still producing water from the air here in the temple. Yes. Let us talk about the quality of the water. Uh, yes, the, our machine is about one month old. We have been uh, drinking water, uh, making tea. As I said, when I was young, you know, 12, 15 years old, I used to go with my father to Nurelia in Sri Lanka, even at eight years, and we used to drink tea. Then that tea was very good because the water was very soft. So our machine here makes similar water like in Nurelia. But is this just your opinion? No, no. We got somebody from Leipzig who knows about water and got him to test. So our water that was tested, ma manufactured, made in this uh, air to water machine was equally good as the best water. It because was a professional company. Yes, it's a professional company. Why the decision for this water system? Is, there are other systems with nets, for example, and they're good too. What's your, what do you say, your system is very good? No, there are passive systems that generate water from uh, mountainous areas where there is a lot of fog. Yes. But the other thing is, as we found out in the internet, that one cubic kilometer of air has 10,000 tons of water to 40,000 tons. How true this is, I hope it is true. But when you have a passive system, you are not sure of getting. But even in our system, we need at least 30% of the humidity with there. So, when we make this system in large scale, in many parts of the world, water will be made available. 
that is the one of the reasons why I went to a active system because the passive system is better if it is functioning but only human there's in the up, up in the mountains you need the fog you do, if you don't have the fog it can't generate so you say <coughs> it's almost available in almost every part of the world not water. not available every part of the world it is available where the humidity is more than 30 percent ah, okay. yes and when you realize this project do you plan to, to work together with other companies and other persons or do you plan it plan, plan it alone uh, no you see uh, my I will give it to Nestle as well as give, give it to the poorest man in the world I will not reserve any rights of, of ma manufacturing water because we are doing a service and not a business but I will get the companies as well as private people to manufacture water with the least amount of cost per liter so I my advice is to generate water with the assistance of the solar energy because that is the cheapest way like four US dollar cents to six US dollar cents per liter and that is very cheap and and this is not only cheap it is not only clean water there is also blessed water healthy water where your heart is talking to the water to get water to generate empathy sympathy and loving kindness and now at the end of our conservation, I'm very excited to test the water. Is it possible? Uh, yes, of course, it's possible. We can go to the water machines and test the water, uh, but then you can make your own opinion, the quality of the water. Uh, before I forget, I want to tell you, we should make in every city, every village, a water ceremony where the people come together and bless the water before they drink the water and pe we people who have good character empathy sympathy loving kindness they shall bless the water and then drink the water then the children who listen to this ceremony will also know what is a good character so good character can be produced with good water and healthy water i would really love to encourage this okay teacher, thank, you. thank you now let's go Okay, Chisa, let's go. Taste yeah, water. let me first fill and just try it out. This is the water from the air. Thank you. And I will give Marcus also a glass of water. Marcus, the principle is very simple. Just taste the water and see. Uh, yes, and I will give you a glass of water. Yes. Please, Peter. Thank you, Jason. I will also taste oh. also that. Wait a minute. Healthy water from the Buddhist teacher house. And less uh, water. <laughs> Thank you. Thank yeah. you. And taste the water and give your opinion. Oh, it really seems very soft. This, this is the taste of the burning air. Yeah. Yes. Yes. Yeah. Bless, yeah. Bless, bless water. From the Buddhist teacher house, the Berliner Luft, yes. Yeah. Yes, that's right. How do you like it's it, Mark? Huh? It's good. It's good, yeah. Refreshing water. It's very soft. Oh. Mm -hmm. And cold. A cold, cold, yes, because this has calves. Hot, mm -hmm. cold, mm -hmm. and normal. Fine, thank It you. makes 71 liters of water. I'm very happy because we can help a lot of people who have thirst and who's used to dirty water and unhealthy water.